this out by then meet some friends of mine. What's going on everybody? Welcome back to Dash Reacts. Let's check out the South Park episode, Le Petit Tourette. Let's do this. Toy Safari. Big Wayne Slammer. Comes with posable neck smash grip. That's pretty cool. Let's see. Cock! <laughs> Sorry. Black Jackal. Karate kick, power force, and bendable neck. Asshole! Ma'am, is that your son over there? Yes, I'm sorry. My son has Tourette syndrome. It's a neurological disorder. He, he can't control what he says. Oh. Shit! Dumb shit! All right, Thomas. Maybe we should go? All right, Mom. Bitch! Ass bitch! Here, let's buy you a nice toy to take home. Stop doing it, South Park. Y'all know y'all set up these situations to get people to laugh at things that aren't supposed to be funny. And it works. Stupid shit! Are you talking to me? No! Cock nose! <laughs> What's your problem, kid? Oh, I I'm sorry. I'm My not gonna make son it, Thomas homie. has Tourette syndrome. People with Tourette's can't control certain tics. It's it's like a sneeze. Asshole! Asshole! Poor kid. Yeah. Are you telling me that if you have this Tourette syndrome, you can say whatever you want all the time and never get in trouble? It's a neurological disorder. He can't help it. Yeah. I've got a golden ticket. <laughs> Cause I've got a golden ticket. Hey, don't you want to buy that toy? I don't need the toy. I found something better. I got a golden chance to make my way. I've got, got a golden, golden chance, chance to make my way. It started about four days ago, Doctor. And every day he seems to get worse. P -p -p oh, P cock. Oh, Shit. dear. I was checking out the internet and it, it almost <laughs> seems like his symptoms are like smiling. those in something called tour. Tourette syndrome? What is that, mommy? Butthole! Titties! Bowels! That doesn't seem likely. Tourette's is a hereditary disease. It doesn't just suddenly start. Mexican stinky bowels! Oh, doctor, can you help him? We will get your son all the help we can. But what about school, doctor? The teachers and the principal, they won't understand that I can't control what I say. Don't worry, young man. We'll make sure everyone understands your disease and gives you the compassion you deserve. Oh, that's awesome. Thank you. Hey, Wendy. Dumb bitch! Uh, sorry. Titties! Cock! Ginger <laughs> tart! Ass liquor face! Oh, good morning, Principal Victoria. Sh balls! Good morning, Eric. <laughs> Did Carbon just say sh balls to the principal? You didn't hear? Well, Carbon has some mental disease called Tourette Syndrome or something. What? He's the luckiest kid in the world. If I could say shit balls to the principal, I'd be so happy. <laughs> uh, excuse me, excuse Great. me, everyone. I, I guess you might have noticed my awkward tics. It's okay, Eric. We all understand, and we think you're very brave. He's faking. <laughs> excuse me, everyone. I need to have a moment alone with my good friend Kyle. You do not have Tourette syndrome, fat ass. Exactly. Oh, okay, you figured me out. Bravo, Kyle. Bravo. Don't you see how awesome this is? It's like a magic cloak that makes me impervious to getting in trouble. Who cares about saying of whatever Of course, you... if you want to be Sergeant Buzzkill once again and spoil my fun because you're jealous you didn't think of it first, well, go right ahead, Cam. Good morning, Mr. Mackey. Ass p <laughs> If I could say ass p to the counselor, I would be so happy. Me too, Craig. What do we get when we multiply a negative number? Dick tits! <laughs> by another negative... Shit! Asshole! Excuse me. It's the awkward silences. Boot, balls, bloody vaginal belch. <laughs> <laughs> you guys don't laugh. It makes me feel insecure about my illness. All you need to remember here is that negative numbers. Tampon! Tampon, it! Will you knock it off already? Kyle, don't you think I wish I could? I'd give anything to be normal like you. Push oh, me, asshole! No. Kyle, watch your language! <laughs> it's just that Eric has become such a distraction, I, I don't think I can teach my class anymore. He wasn't a distraction before? Eric, do you need to sit in the corner until your flaming gas is under control? <laughs> I want to help your class better understand this illness. Piss! No! Up yours, fat boy! Kyle, please! I'm sorry! Carmen's Tourette's isn't real! He's faking! You think people with Tourette's are faking? 
No, I'm just saying that I think... Do you have any idea how horrible that is to say? Ass! Ass! We aren't <laughs> faking, young man. Trust me. Nobody wants this illness. Ass piss! Piss! That's right, Cal. Crap-filled vagina! I'd like to take this bully to see that Tourette's is very real. Piss! Tourette's is like a cough or a sneeze. <gasps> it isn't contagious like some people think. <laughs> a lot of people with Tourette's have different tics. My tick is that I have to bend my neck and snap my fingers. But a lot of people don't even notice it. I always thought that that was more of what Tourette's was. Like the uncontrollable movements, like some of these kids, or like Tweak. And I'm sure the, the cursing thing does happen, but it's something I gotta look into. Coprolalia. These kids can't control their actions. Ass! Piss in the ass! Look, I was just suggesting that maybe this one person could control what he said, but just didn't. For fun. Fun? <laughs> this really isn't all that fun. <laughs> ah, shit! <laughs> Piss coming from my ass! You wanna know about fun? Going to public places knowing you're gonna make a fool of yourself. My dad finally couldn't take it anymore. He divorced my mom, said he'd still be around, but I only see him at Christmas time now. Shit! The worst part is I know how lonely my mom is. A lot of times I know she'd be better off if I was dead. Oh, Dude. man. Your mom would not be better off if you were dead, Thomas. Even if people like Kyle here think so. Aw, oh, come on! Our son is a good kid. He just didn't understand Tourette's was a real disease. The only thing left now is for your son to apologize to his little classmate. Oh man. I'm sorry. Uh, what was that? I, I couldn't quite make that out, Cap. I'm sorry. You're starry? I, I don't get what you mean by that, Cal. You're starry because I... I said I'm sorry, you piece of... <laughs> oh, oh, no, don't worry about it, Cal. I understand. I've learned to deal with intolerance. Dumb shit, douchebag! And it means a lot that you're standing here apologizing with your dad and lovely mother. Fat Jew! Jew bitch! Oh, man, you just want to hit Cartman so much? Well, I think we can all put this behind us now. Piss out my ass! Yeah, piss out your ass right onto Kyle's mom's fat fuck Jew face! Oh, 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 goodness, excuse me. Jeez, that was a bad one. Well, gotta run, everybody. Got some big things in the works. Isn't having Tourette's awesome? It's a Dateline special report. I'm Chris Hansen. You probably know me from To Catch a Predator, where we bust men looking for s with children. Yeah. Go ahead and take a seat. Take a seat right over there. Oh, God. Oh, no. <laughs> what are you doing here? <laughs> I'm just being stupid, I guess. Is that freaking Leroy? She ran away now. She got to deal with the dog, huh? Take a seat right over there. Oh, God. Oh, no. <laughs> what are you doing here? I'm just being stupid, I guess. And what are you doing here tonight, Jeff? Hanging out? Hanging out with whom? But now we're switching our focus from pet to Tourette syndrome. I received this touching letter from a brave little boy in Colorado. Dear Mr. Hansen, I have Tourette's, and I want the world to understand what it's like. Won't you do a special report on me so that the world can learn to accept us instead of just laugh? Donkey boner! This Saturday on Dateline, you I'll be bringing it? you Eric's story, live and uncensored. Living with Tourette's, the Eric Cartman story. This Saturday on Dateline NBC. Finally, my wish of going public with my illness can come true. Goddamn Jews! Suck my ass barf! Care for a scotch? Scotch? Carl, I've won. No matter how you look at it. I'm going to blast the Jews, Kyle. I'm going to call them every name in the book and people will call it brilliant television. They'll probably give me an Emmy. You are not going to go on national television and spew a bunch of hate speech about Jewish people. I won't let you do it, Cartman. Then the game is on, Kyle. It's not a game, you derelict. And this isn't scotch, it's apple juice. <laughs> do you have any idea how liberating it is to say whatever comes to mind? Big titties, butt much. There's no walls anymore, shit. Whatever enters my brain, I can just say without thinking about it. I wet my bed last night. What did you say? Uh, n nothing. You aren't gonna get away with this, you stupid asshole! Huh. Hmm. That was weird. Yeah. Tonight, Eric Cartman will go on television and become the spokesman for Tourette's Syndrome. Piss out my ass! <laughs> Thanks, everybody. Suck my balls! 
You've all been so understanding and supportive of my illness. Jim Farmer, this sneeze. And it is because of you that I have the courage to go on national television tonight. Titty sprinkles. Titty sprinkles. If I could say titty sprinkles on national television, I would be so happy. And I also just want to say that I'm making this all up. Uh, uh, I'm huh. making this all up to you for putting up with my mental disorder. I cry at night because I don't have a dad. Ah! Oh, no. What the hell is going on? It's okay, Eric. We understand your illness, okay? What I meant to say was ass liquor cum balls. And uh, I'm secretly in love with Patty Nelson. I fantasize about kissing Patty Nelson. Ew. <laughs> Again, butters. Hey, Eric. Hey, Jimmy. Butters, do you think it's possible that you can lose your ability to filter what you say? If somebody got used to saying whatever came to their mind, could they start saying things that they would normally never say? Well, who are you mm. talking about? Uh, my cousin. My cousin! One time, my cousin and I touched wieners! Ah! You and your cousin touched wieners? <laughs> I didn't say that. Yes, I did, but why? Ah! Stop it! Excuse me! Excuse me, I need to go. Gotta run! Is there a problem, sweetie? I just... I, I just want to thank everyone for coming. My cousin and I touched wiener. We, wiener, winter. Winter is a cold time of year. Uh, I need to be going now. I wet my bed. I touched my cousin's wiener. This sure has been fun. Goodbye. Ah! <laughs> Carmen's admitting all this stuff without meaning to, but it's the stuff that we don't see. Because we always see like the scheming, the, the conniving, the, the brat side of Cartman. Are there any South Park episodes you recommend that show that side of Cartman that we don't usually get to see? If so, let me know in the comments. I'm Chris Hansen. I'm Chris Hansen. Uh, Mr. Hansen, I'm afraid I can't do the show. Why not? My, uh, my grandma just died, so I have to go to Memphis. That's not true, my grandma's fan. Why could the funeral have been on a school day? God, she didn't take this long to die. All of a sudden, I can't control what I say. Well, of course you can't control what you say. You have Tourette's. No, my Tourette's has gotten worse. Before, I just blurted out cool stuff about Jews being lame and stuff. But now it's gotten really bad. So, I I'm sorry, but I'm not doing the show. That's it. Goodbye. Why don't you take a seat? Oh, I don't want to take a seat. Have a seat. No, I'm just going to go... Take a seat right over there. <laughs> he goes back. How you doing? Pretty good. Good. Why don't you have a seat right over there? How does he do that? <laughs> You know, one time, I was doing a show called To Catch a Predator. We almost caught this pet out, but then he ran from us because he didn't want to be on Dateline. So we tracked him down to his house. And you know what he did? He himself. Didn't that really happen? They confronted the suspect. He told them he wasn't going to hurt them. And then up in the head. It'd be a shame if you didn't want to go on Dateline. It'd be a shame if we had to track you down and you yourself I just peed my pants tonight an inside look at Tourette syndrome I'm Chris Hansen. in a few minutes you will meet what? little Eric Cartman who wants the world to understand his affliction five minutes kid Jesus Christ how did I get myself into this it's your own damn fault I should have never pretended to have Tourette syndrome but see I, I get it now you can't just walk around saying whatever you want. You gave us a filter because people don't want to hear things like, I touch penises with my cousin! <laughs> <laughs> you must see how this is all somewhat your fault, right? Please. Man. I need a miracle. All right, then we go with the plan. Just like to catch a predator. This is probably hot for boys 219. Are you cute, Billy 182? Yeah, I was chatting with you online. Shut. Oh, God, I'm so turned on right now. This is your house? Your, your parents aren't home, are they? No, go on inside. I made brownies. Shh. Cock! Okay, cock! Don't take too long. <laughs> oh, oh. Wait a minute. This ain't no house. Chris Hansen! Oh no, it's a setup! I knew it! Sir, why don't you take a seat right over there? Now everyone's gonna know I'm a perv! Oh! 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 Oh, not again! Surprise, fat ass! I went online posing as a boy who would have sex with older men and told them to meet me here. My plan worked perfectly. Uh. Hey, when are we gonna get to some action, huh? Oh. Scar! Oh no, it's Chris Hansen! No! 
Are they all gonna don't? I knew it! There aren't really brownies! Oh Jesus. Have something to do with this? Answer me! Stupid shit! Ha! Nobody talks to me like that. Why don't you take a seat? Take a seat right over there. Suck it! Asshole liquor fart! Why you I'll I'll tell on you! You're the coolest kid in the world. If I could call Chris Hansen an asshole licking fart to his face, I would be so happy. Could I just like hang out with you sometime? Like do your laundry, baby? <laughs> Take a look, fat ass. I beat you. You aren't going on Dateline. What do you have to say now? Oh, thank you. Thank you, Cal. <laughs> what? I asked God to send someone to help me, and you came, Cal. I love you, man. No, I beat you. You totally saved my ass, Cal. You must really care about me. See you, Cal. I gotta get to a psychiatrist and learn to control what I say. I gotta go to take it. Thank you, Walking Cal. around the dead bodies. It's like Cartman got what he deserved, but he didn't. But anyway, it was a really strong episode. I really enjoyed it. Great recommendation. Thank you so much. If you enjoyed this reaction, please make sure to give this video a like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.